In the high desert of Turkey, near the Syrian border, Gobekli Tepe is one of the oldest sites ever discovered. It existed long before biblical times and is now providing scientists with important new information about our evolution. Gobekli Tepe is unique and it's, it's a very early expression of, of human cultural development. It's 6,000 years earlier than the pyramids, it's 6,000 years earlier than, the, than Stonehenge, for example, in, in, in Britain. In total years, it's about 11,500 years in its earlier layers. While surviving the ages, Gobekli Tepe is in mortal danger of vanishing if steps are not taken to save it. It's a very sensitive site. It's one of the oldest sites in the world. So you're looking at both architectural and structural and all of the artifacts, statuary, all that has to be protected. Walking around Gebekli Tepe, it's an open book. This is not a settlement, it's a sanctuary. All, all the monuments at the site are not domestic. They are belonging to this part with the T-shapes. Gobekli Tepe is important for another reason. Gobekli Tepe is actually quite a jewel. This is probably one of the most important milestones in human development is, is all represented in this site. The sculpture, the architecture, the process of how they came to that because it's the first monumental site humans have ever developed with major art. First time that we have life-size human heads that be it's a leopard, but it, it's, it's a very big, big sculpture. It's not a miniature, it's not a figurine, it's a sculpture. Global Heritage Fund is playing a central role in making the survival of this remarkable place possible. So our work is really uh, focused on the protection of the site and the German Archaeological Institute is really working, their funding is for the research and the excavation of the site. We are getting easily money for research, but we don't get easily money for conservation. The main thing is a visitor center where the people will be prepared a little bit. They don't have a person who can explain detailed uh, history of it. Success is based on GHF's model of training, involving the community to become the stewards of Gobekli Tepe. We're training the local community as a guide association for the site and also working on a number of ways that they can earn income from the visiting tourists so that they're some of the primary beneficiaries. The Global Heritage Fund is, is, a, is an ideal partner because they have experience from Chattelhoek, they have experience for this period, mainly the conservation, the presentation of the site to the publicity. The Global Heritage Fund, through preservation by design, working worldwide to save our vanishing heritage.